Hi everybody, my name is Taylor Green. I'm one of the audiologists here at Audiology Associates. Uh, my name is Rhys Barber. I'm the other audiologist here at Audiology Associates. You guys together again today. Yay! It's been ages. It's been a while. <laughs> um, so this is my patient. I think there's four patients in here all together. Uh, so just very soft, very deep wax. Not any, not nice ones to remove these no, ones. Not easy. No. Nope. Very rarely they come away clean either, do they? They usually leave a little bit of debris behind. And they, they normally never come away in one in one go. No, no, always, no it's uh, always bits of a, break yeah, away little, this. little tiny spots. Yeah. So it's oh, yeah, nice Shot up the suction too. <laughs> that one. <laughs> nice big chunky piece, that one. Let's have a little look. Yeah, there's quite a bit there down in that recess as well, by the looks of it. I'm having to drop to the one side here just to be able to get the angle I need to get the tube down. Yeah, I think you're quite lucky there that the, the ear canal is not narrow because they, oh. <laughs> they're a bit of a pain when they... Uh, when you have them to hold the ear open and try and shimmy away. Oh, there we are. That's, That's a happy. good piece coming out of the recess there. I think if it was narrow, I'd probably opt to use a bit of irrigation rather than suction, I think. Yeah, fair yeah. enough, yeah. I think that would, that, would, that would bring it away really nicely. Let's have a look at that now then. Oh, that's actually come away quite nicely. It has, it has. There Couldn't really see that bit in the, in the recess. <laughs> no, <laughs> it, it, it was it really deep in there, wasn't it? It was really a polar oh. opposite now. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. But uh, very, very dark wax, very hard wax, lots of hair in here as well. A mixture of everything you don't want to see. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So just giving us a little bit of a wiggle. This is a standard size ulna tube in here as well, guys, just to take this bit away. Is this mine or yours? No, I can't. Do you know it's still not? the same patient, is it? No, different patient. Oh. <laughs> so I think this might have... Oh, yeah, because I didn't have a ruler shot in the last one because it all got sucked inside the tube. Oh, of course, of course, yeah. yeah. I don't know. I've started putting it on the on the new ones I had it. I put a little T or a little R at the top so we ah, know who's so done know which one then. Because we can't tell to... anymore. We've both got the same cameras now. Because we spoilt Taylor and got him a nice camera. I <laughs> said <laughs> so we can't tell the difference anymore. Um, oh, a little bit of a fling, flinch there. Sometimes patients, especially when they've got this hairy wax, uh, is more likely to prompt that Arnold's reflex, isn't it? So yeah. more likely to give it a bit of a bit of a cough, which I think probably what that's that's what that was. I think sometimes as well they they uh, the patients tend to feel that when the the, the wax is quite uh, not sticky but stuck to the yeah. ear canal so even if it's quite a dry wax when yeah. you're sort of lifting and peeling this away sometimes as it suddenly like detaches off the ear canal some patients will feel that kind of a um a a, a, like a resistance mm. yeah like a little yeah a bit of a pull so they think oh what what you know what was that yeah <laughs> and uh that yeah, I think that's, that yeah, so, and you, sometimes you get a little bit of coughing with it, which is uh, pretty pretty standard, really, with, the, <laughs> yeah, with, with the wax reflex. Yeah, with wax removal, yeah, you do see it quite often, the Arnold's reflex. So we've managed to pull this bit out now with the uh, standard size, standard size? No, Jobs and Horn even. <laughs> standard size Jobs standard, and Horn. Standard, yeah, they're all that size, it is a standard size, it's Jobs and Horn. So we're taking this one away. We always opt to use oval, oval. I, I prefer oval than round yeah, Jobs and Horns, yeah, I just think they, they've got more use. A um, little bit stuck to the to the roof here. We're just going to get rid of this. Got the, uh, the 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 cilia and this patient said the hair in the ear is actually it's quite long in this one. It's, it's uh, dense you, in there. Yeah, you could see it at the entrance when you pull it out of the ear. Yeah. How, just how long those those and thick those those yeah. hairs are. Like rope. Yeah. <laughs> but it's looking a lot better. Well, yeah, there's the plug we pulled oh, out. So lovely. Half a centimeter, quarter of an inch. Quarter of an inch. Yeah. Quarter of an inch. Bang on. Look at that. Two. Um, I think that's one's yours. Oh, yeah, I think that's one's yours. Oh, thanks to everyone who commented on our Radio Wales appearance as well the other day. Oh, we yeah. thoroughly enjoyed that. Yeah, that was, I was good listening. fun. I was listening. Yeah, as he went down. I was in clinic, but I was kind of cutting. I was like kind of flicking between the <laughs> yeah, clinic is. and the radio. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think we did. Because we I was down in the studio, which I've never done before. So I think there are some pictures on our other platforms of. Um, me in the studio down in BBC Radio Wales as well. If you want to check those out on sort of Instagram, uh, I think it's Instagram on Facebook? that one. Facebook. I'm not too sure. I think it's just Instagram. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, I'll have a little look. We're yeah. going to try and put them on some of the other platforms as well. So we'll get them. Um, Completely missed the wax from over there. <laughs> <laughs> Finished it already. <laughs> Wasn't that important, so, guys? Fine. It was only a quick one. It was a quick one. Yeah, uh, yeah it came away really, really well. That's what it looked like before. <laughs> Ta-da! Yeah. <laughs> like well, magic. Yeah. Well, that partic this particular patient actually wasn't having any issues with the hearing at all, uh, but just came in for a general cleanup. I think this patient comes into us every 12 months, I, I think. Um, 
so we normally see something very very similar in this particular patient's case but uh, you can see quite a quite a hairy dry sort of long plug not so not so much a a, a thick sort of occluding plug um, so yeah just a general cleanup of this particular patient bit of resistance there though it's quite hard isn't it? yeah you can kind of see the skin kind of pulling with it as well as i'm trying to pull this out to so it's rather than it, as well as it being quite a long plug that the the start of this is also a little bit wide as well so we're having to squeeze it through i could have opted for a jobs and horn here but i obviously didn't the thing is if it's moving i know every, it, you know yeah. i know you should use the best tool for the job but if it's moving with the tool you've got i would just stick with the tool i've got i would yeah. Yeah, so the okay. eardrums are looking perfect, yeah. Textbook. Little little, little porcupine-y kind of wax, isn't it? I read to the hairy bits all jutting around the outside. I'm still getting used to these new rulers. I know. That's definitely <laughs> so an, an inch. Yes, yeah, it's an inch there. It's an inch, yeah. We've got three, just two, two and a, two two and a half, and half centimetres. Yeah, two yeah. and a half centimetres. Uh, no, I would have said this was your video, but I don't know now. We've lost track. I think we'll just wait. So, do you know, I'm going to get so much stick in the comments because everybody <laughs> tells me off for talking over your videos. They oh, forgot that was your video, and I just talked straight over it again. Yeah, that's all right. I said, I'll let Taylor talk through mine. How about that? There you go. We'll make up. For no, it. don't put me under pressure. <laughs> no. uh, keep talking. Keep talking. Uh, uh, this is, a, this is um, <laughs> yes. There was some wax in this patient's ears, and we got that out. So that's a, that's all you need. Really. Um, quite a quite a similar one to your second one. The the dark thick sort of hairy wax that you that you had there I mean, it is uh, and, and again this is the standard size zolna tube so it, we're just sort of wide enough for the ear canal here at the moment the problem you sometimes get with these ones um it, it, where we're having to hold the ear open sometimes you'll find that the the ear canal with the standard size tube will will sort of start collapsing in so it almost creates like a bit of a vacuum seal inside the ear canal yeah. which we obviously have to avoid. Yes. I think we've gone in with a fine end here now. Yeah. Sometimes there's just not quite enough room, is it, to get those two tools in, but a fine end does make a difference. But you sacrifice such a... Oh, no, we've got a crocodile forceps. Ooh. So we've obviously... Um, I, 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 then I, I can't even remember if this is me or, or you. you. I, I, you really I can't remember this. I doesn't, this doesn't ring a bell to <laughs> no, me. This is probably done a little while ago. Uh, <laughs> this was A and others. Uh, you actually... Hopefully, I don't know. I, can't, I honestly can't remember whether this is mine or yours. Um, but we did a good job anyway. No, it was awesome. That's good. That's that's sure. Whoever that was, that was an amazing <laughs> job. <laughs> it's coming away. There you go. Out that comes. Yeah, we got lucky with the forceps there. I thought might have been a little bit too soft it with the forceps. Did you could see like it was a, yeah. What's this? A little bit of skin, maybe a little bit of keratin at the top. Oh, I don't know. Is he going to pull everything oh, else with it? Oh. That's what you always oh, want to... Ooh, oh, ooh. It's good. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, you always... That's really what you're hoping for when we're using these, uh, these manual tools. Is as we're pulling these bits forward, we, we're kind of hoping that it pulls everything further into the ear right. forwards. And I think that's what's happened here. As we've it pulled it out, like it's it. pulled it right near the entrance of the ear. It's great with these, these sort of uh, narrow ear canals in it when yeah. it, this happens. So much easier to remove then. There that goes. Oh, that's looking. Oh. Look, so much better. What a good job you did there, Taylor Green. And yeah, you did a good job as well. Thank you very much. Was, that was absolutely yeah, perfect. Was awesome. That was spot on. Oh, we've got to do another one. Here we go. Um, this one doesn't look as well. It doesn't look as <laughs> narrow, uh, first of all. Right on the entrance to the canal, though. Bit of a, bit of a, I wouldn't say a sharp piece of wax, but like a really narrow. Um, angular. Uh, angular, that's the word I was mm. thinking of. Uh, that's the word. Quite difficult to get a suction grip on most of the time because you, you have to try and f almost fold the ear yeah. canal, which is obviously what we're doing there. Um, just to try and get a grip on that flat, that flat piece, a flat edge. And uh, same again, is that going to all pull that, that deeper section forwards? It might do because that does look quite. You moved it there. It looked like quite a bit of it moved at the same time, so it does look a little bit harder. It's whether you can get enough of a grip on the edge here. That's the key to it. Uh, no just way. tearing through it. It's not quite there, is it? <clears throat> That's kind of what I was expecting on the on yes. the other ear. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. 
did look like that. It's the thing is, or oh, there's a gap there now. It you you kind of you could the difficulty the difficulty <laughs> is you got a gap there. We've also got a nice flat <coughs> surface now for the suction tube to hold on to. So it's oh right okay that's, that's <laughs> we didn't do either of those two things. I thought we were going to go in with a, either a, oh gosh right, okay is this coming out? Ah, oh, we're towards the end and we forgot to do the. Yes, okay. Oh, uh, guys, if you enjoyed the videos, don't forget to like, heart, share, follow, subscribe for me. That'd be absolutely fantastic. Thank you so much. We love new subscribers. Uh, hello to all new subscribers. Subscribe, can't speak. Subscribers. Um, I, I can barely talk. Anyway, <laughs> oh, there we go. Up. Look at that. Ooh, there we that go. is a chunky piece. <coughs> Quite long as well. That was a fair length, wasn't it? Look at that going all the way down. Oh, it's looking perfect. Very nice. Don't forget, guys, if you do have problems with your ears, that might be wax related, hearing related, tinnitus related, anything at all, you can come along and have a chat to us here. Check out a link to our uh, website in the bio or the channel page and you can book yourself the point with, with this amazing oh, Mr. Tim Green or myself. <laughs> um, <laughs> so, you got, so you got four centimetres, one and, one and a half, half inches. inches. That was a failed amount in there. Well done us on that yeah. one. Yeah, we did well. And uh, oh, uh, wish me luck for for Sunday as well, guys. We've got another another longish run to do on, uh, on Sunday. Yeah, we got a got a got a castle to castle run on Sunday. So it's we're castle running, to castle. We're running from the Kafili Castle to Cardiff Castle, which is about eleven Ooh, miles. That's so, a fair distance. Yeah, and it's uh, I'm kind of hoping the weather's going to cool down a little bit because it's been it's been very warm. It's yeah. been very humid oh, here oh. the last couple of days. But, uh, this is where we get stick now for the American. Yes. <laughs> 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 that's, that's not warm. 28 degrees. That's, that's, that's warm for us. <laughs> don't forget, we don't really see that yellow thing in the sky very often here in Wales. Yeah, uh, good luck to me as well. I have a run to the fridge on oh. Sunday. I'm back, yeah, with maybe a beer or two. I'm quite jealous, actually. Yeah, yeah. I might even do a, you know, like a fast-paced walk rather than a run. I'll see how we get on. <laughs> there's, power, there's power walks where you see them waddling. <laughs> Uh, anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching our video today. And uh, as always, take care of yourselves. Take care of your ears. And take care of one another. We'll see you again real soon. Bye, everyone. Bye.